Hey there and welcome to another video with me. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a payment trust badge on your Shopify store. So an example would be like this. So at the bottom of your product, you do have a trust badge uh, that says the payment systems are secure. So they are guaranteed a checkout, right? So this is just an example that I've added for one of my clients, but I'm going to illustrate one for you. One of the common issues that i've come across while reviewing some of my clients website is they do post the cost badge on every single product at the bottom of every single product when uploading the product on the shopify store i'll say there's nothing wrong with that you're absolutely doing a great job but there is an inconvenience with doing that way so i'm explaining myself what happened if you have 500 products you know a hundred products 200 products a thousand products are you going to spend time to post the secure badge on every single product yes you can do that but it's not a very scalable way and it's not and at the same time it's not a very productive activity so you know today i'm going to show you how to get that secure badge on all of your products that you add on your shopify store without having to uh, do that manually all the time so let's go uh the very first thing you need to do is you need to log in at the back end of your shopify store you need to have this specific i will give you this specific code right this is a code that i'm going to give you you know this is a secure badge right secure with paypal visa american express and so on uh if you want to have a badge like this you can just go on google and type trust badge right this is a cost badge i do have many trust badges um you know you can basically download the trust badge if you want to download the trust badge and then come here on your shopify store come here on your shopify store click on settings on settings you need to click on files so on files you need to upload the trust badge that you have so in this case i do have the trust badge on my desktop right so i have many trust badges by the way i've already uploaded this specific trust badge so all you need to do is you need to upload that but make sure when you download the trust badge from from google make sure it's png right it has to be png and once you do that um, you, you need to upload that png trust badge into your Shopify store as I've done here. So once you've uploaded every trust badge, right? Every file that you upload on Shopify has a URL. So you need to head down, head up here and copy the URL. This is a specific URL that you need. You just need to right click on it and then copy. So basically you're going to head back into your Word document and where it says insert where you know it start where the brackets are these brackets right these two brackets so you're going to copy from the end of this bracket up to this point and then you're going to paste that specific url there okay awesome you've done that I'm going to leave the link of this uh, specific URL of that code snippet in the description below. So you won't have any issue with that. You can download it. And once I've done it, and I need to head back into my Shopify store and then click on online store. And once you're online store, you need to head here to actions and click on edit code. Once you're in this specific area, you need to head down to section, click on section. And on section, you will find product template. So you click on product template and then you will have this specific page. And once you're on the on product template, you need to click control F in order to get the search button. If you're on a PC, you need to click uh control f if you're on mac you need to click command f in order to get uh, to have the search button and you need to type here product dot 
description right so before i even type the whole thing as you can see down here there's product dot description so now what i will do is where 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 you see the division tag where i've pointed my uh my mouse here you need to hit enter to give a bit of space and then you head back into your your word document file copy the whole code and then paste it down here so as you can see everything has been pasted down here and once you've done that you need to hit save so it says asset save used so guys this is just an example on how to get the trust badge on your shopify store you know it's not as complicated as you think you know if you want me to review your shopify store uh you know after you build or you want me to build your shopify store for you you can reach out to me i'll leave a link of my contact form down below if you also need help with advertising on facebook google instagram i mean you name it reach out to me i'll be more than willing to help you and thank you for watching this video and i'm looking forward to hearing from you take care bye